Alright, so this video is gonna be a little more on the shorter side, because not only is tomorrow upload day, but it's also my first day of high school. And since I'm such a procrastinating little bastard, I haven't started to record this video till 12 in the morning. So back in my Nikocado Avocado video, I said that I might do another video on this other mukbang YouTuber called Hungry Fat Chick. And yes, that's her actual name. Also, if you haven't seen my Nikocado video yet, you should definitely watch it. Because some of the points I use are going to be from that video. Also, if you could maybe, you know, click that little red button down there, I think you know which one I'm talking about. You know, you know the one, right? You know, it, it, it's the subscribe button. Press the subscribe button. Also, join my Discord. Anyways, so Hungry Fat Chick is basically the girl version of Nikocado Avocado. Except there's one big difference. And that is she actually tried to lose weight. Or at least she says she tried to lose weight. But if you take a little gander at her YouTube videos, you'll see that, um, yeah, I don't think that's trying to lose weight. But the main problem with this YouTube video is the same as Nikocado Avocado. In fact, it's the same for almost every obese mukbang YouTuber. In the current state that her body's in, and with her eating all of this food, she's basically slowly killing herself. And she's in even worse shape than Nick is. So if you do the math, things are looking fairly grim. Unless she completely changes her diet, she's gonna die in a few years. And that's the thing. She's not gonna change her diet, because she knows that the only reason people watch her is to see her slowly die. So why would she change it if she knows that it's giving her a paycheck every week? But what she needs to understand is that sure, for now, being obese is making her wealthy, but if she doesn't change her ways, she's not going to live long enough to appreciate that wealth. Jesus Christ, I feel like a fucking philosopher. And I think that's the main moral of the story here. No one wants to be the court jester. No one wants to be the class clown. Because even though you might become popular and people will give you attention, you will always be known as the fool who ripped his pants. Thank you for watching this extremely short and mini video. I'll try and make a longer video next week, but first let's see how bad high school is. Speaking of which, it is now approximately 1.08 in the morning. And... Yeah, I should probably get some sleep before the big day. And as a little bonus because of how short this video is, please watch this extremely funny blooper of me. Now, being obese is making her wealthy, but if she doesn't change her ways, she's not going to live along, live along, live along. God damn it. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>